The Megola is a German motorcycle produced between 1921 and 1925. It came into variants, the touring version and the sporting version. The Megola featured fuel tanks, a fuel gauge, tachometer, and meter, and a hand-controlled butterfly valve to regulate the throttle. This classic motorcycle was remarkably beautiful and weirdly unique. Utilizing a 640cc radial engine mounted within the front wheel's framework. Despite its flexibility, this engine lacked both a transmission and a clutch. The Megola engine delivered a modest power output of 14 bhp, applied directly to the wheel. Built by George's Roy from 1928 to 1934. The Majestic is considered one of those revolutionary and unusual vehicles that left a significant mark on the automotive industry. The Majestic transformed motorcycle mass production for decades. The bike featured a pressed steel structure that resembled car design more than, or should I say, normal motorcycles. This innovative framework supported many components within a single unit. Roy's design eliminated complex welding by riveting steel panels together into a monocoque chassis, which served as both the bodywork and frame. The steel panels formed a semicircular spar arrangement connecting the steering head directly to the bike's rigid rear axle and enclosing the rear wheel in a streamlined steel fender. Quasar is a semi-enclosed motorcycle that adopted the feet-forward concept. This strange design changed the rider's position to sitting inside and down, rather than the traditional straddling position. The Quasar features a cabin with a roof, a laminated glass windscreen, car-style wipers, and a heater. It is also weirdly unique for repurposing the engine from the three-wheel Reliant Robin car. The 850cc four-cylinder inline engine allowed the Quasar to cruise at 90 to 100 miles per hour, with the capability to exceed this limit under favorable conditions. The 150 TAP was a customized anti-tank scooter designed specifically for French paratroopers. Ateliers de construction de motorcycles and automobiles launched the initial model, the 150 TAP, in 1956, later enhancing it with a reinforced frame and a 3-inch M2075 mm recoilless rifle. Typically, the scooters were parachute dropped in pairs with a two-person team. One scooter carried the gun and an M1917 Browning machine gun tripod, while the other was loaded with ammunition. The 150 TAP featured a 150cc two-stroke engine, reaching a top speed of 37 miles per hour. Vespa manufactured only 600 units between 1956 and 1959. The Harfordshire Superbike Centre in the UK constructed the remarkable 48-cylinder Tinker toy motorcycle. 
This extraordinary bike is powered by 16 Kawasaki two-stroke three-cylinder KH to 5 engines, arranged in six groups of eight. With a total capacity of 4,200 cc, the engine uses a 125 cc single-cylinder two-stroke donkey engine as a starter motor, instead of a traditional electronic starter. The Tinker Toy is equipped with a BMW K100 gearbox, a fuse box, six carburetors, an electric fuel pump, and three ignition units. Astonishingly, this motorcycle is road legal and holds the Guinness World Record for having the most cylinders in a vehicle engine. That's that for today, folks. Join us later again for another group of weirdest and most innovative motorcycles we have ever seen.